Okay, hi everyone. I'm here with your uh, Thanksgiving activity for this Tuesday. So you're gonna be creating pattern block turkeys. So to create a turkey using pattern blocks, you're gonna use your picture to answer the questions below. Create an equation multiplying a whole number by a fraction representing the fractional amount of each pattern block used in your drawing. Use mixed numbers for your products. Okay, so um, you're not gonna answer these questions until after you make your pattern block turkey. So you're going to cut out your pattern blocks that I've given you, and then you're going to use those to design a turkey on your white sheet of paper. You obviously can use them more than once, okay, because you are tracing them. So here's an example of mine. Okay, so I used the hexagons down here for the body, and then I just filled in the shapes to make my turkey. Okay, and obviously you can color yours too if you would like, but this is kind of what you're gonna do, and no one's turkey is gonna be the same, so you don't need to try and copy mine, you need to make your own, but you will need to cut out the pattern blocks and use them to help you. When you are done, you're going to be filling out the questions here. So let's say um, you use 10 hexagons. You would have 10 times your, frat, your hexagon was one out of how many total uh, pattern blocks you use. So for mine, for example, I had seven hexagons times one over 44 blocks. So seven times one over 44, when you multiply seven times one is seven over 44, so my fraction would be seven over 44. You'll do that for each of your pattern blocks. And then at the very bottom, you will create three equivalent fractions for the fractional amounts representing each of your shapes. So you'll do three equivalents for hexagons, three for trapezoids, three for rhombi, and three for triangles. What you need to do in the order, the correct order, so you'll cut out your shapes, you'll make your turkey, you'll trace them, you'll answer the questions, and then you can color if you would like. You do not have to color, but you should upload a picture of your paper and your turkey to Google Classroom. If you have any questions, let me know.